Now, let me be even more clear. As it relates to the lost dollars, the resolution that I believe has been presented was for you all to vote against the referendum. What the referendum allows the citizens and unincorporated South Fulton to do is vote in support or against creating a city. That's what it does. So your resolution would be opposing a person's right to vote. So it is your right as the city of South of East Point to decide if you want to oppose the right to vote, but I want you to consider it in that way. Uh, and Webster, not me, says that voter suppression is using your political power in order to stop someone from expressing their right to vote. And you are a political body. The resolution would be a power, and that resolution would be presented to the 180 members of the House and the members of the Senate expressing you don't want someone else to have a right to vote. Now, let me say one other thing. I would like to apologize on behalf of anyone who may have been offended. I have heard rumors that there have been disparaging marks made against the city of East Point by citizens supporting cityhood. And on their behalf, let me say I am sorry. I have not heard that, but I will make a better effort to make it clear that that is inappropriate because I recognize that East Point has worked very hard with this administration to turn over your reputation that was built by administrations that came before you. And I congratulate you for that, and no one should do that to you. But understand what I have heard. I have heard people expressing, I don't want to live in East Point, Atlanta, Union City, a number of other cities because that is their choice. But I will say that if you think about it, I'm not a PR expert, but if your reputation is what you are concerned about by people uh, putting it down, saying they don't want to live in East Point, let me ask you what those same people are going to say when they find out for the first time probably in Georgia history a predominantly African-American city used their political power to stop another predominantly African-American city from being created. I think that's going to give those haters that you're worried about a chance to say, see what I mean?